Hello YouTubers, I hope you enjoyed about show today. Today is the tier list for post master memories and the new YC, the, two, the free YCS they had in a row. So first up we got Cash Tier. Cash Tier won one event, they done very well, they still showed up a lot, but there's a lot of different things they're doing with Cash Tier. Depends what weird varying you're doing, so you have to keep up with the trends at the moment, it's sort of coming a little bit strange at the moment. And stuff, so Cash Tier is definitely the best deck of the format, yep. But depends what variant you're playing. There's the pure one, there's the Rudic version, there's one with Ibli, some strange reason, yep. Uh, Pole. Rooted po Pole for Pole Control, it's definitely a tier 2, it's definitely fixed, the Rooted definitely fixed the option and the new ships definitely fixed a lot of the issues, now you can put opponent mods and give whatever attribute you need for the opponent, which is good and quite handy to say the least, which is cool, which is good. The issue now is, with deck is, it's still one of those decks, it's very complicated to remember, you're trying to do a lot of stuff to try and do... You're trying to do a lot of stuff and you have to always know what your opponent's doing, so... Which is crazy, yeah. Um, branded... Uh, Brandespians is like... The second best deck, I would say, personally. So it's like, there. And branded is... Just the same, it's just the same old variant. Didn't do very well the wires, it's too easy to counter people playing the hand trials for good down life. That's the issue. It's one of the best decks, but at the moment it it can be one of the most It's one of the best decks, but it could be easy counter. If you know what you're doing. Heroes are rogue. Everyone loves heroes. I love them too. They seem pretty good this format, but they're not as good as they should be, which is a shame. Exister. Ah, get out of here. Get out of here, Exorcist. Get out. You're not very good. You're not good to begin with. You were only good because of tear, but now there's no tear. It's not the same. Wondery. Get out of here. I haven't seen you for a few weeks, actually. Yeah, I haven't seen you for a few weeks. It's a shame, but hey ho. You play badly, you anyway, so it doesn't even matter. Gold Pride, they've got a chance. Next format, they've definitely still got a chance. Spot, um, Gold Pride with the Punk Engine. Hopefully the new stuff will be good for the deck and start a lot of the issues, but the deck at the moment is pretty good what it wants to do and stuff, which is good, which is cool. But it can't do the same. Um... Dark Worlds is fun, very good. Very, if you want a good meta deck, you want Dark Worlds because it can do a lot of stuff. And can be fun, and it's good. It got good matchups against quite a lot of stuff, which is cool. Sky Strikers, Rogue, yeah. It's not the same anymore, but it's still a good engine. There were some Sky Striker engines in Cash Tears, some strange reason, yeah. Labyrinth are one of the best, unfortunately, I don't like deck, but deck does well, so, fair booze. Um, Scare Claws, really good, really powerful, really easy to play, if you want deck, it's really easy to pilot, it's really good, and it can do what it needs to do, yeah. Um, Mad Max is good. Very good deck, very good what it needs to do, just OTK out of nowhere, or go first and make it really hard. The board doesn't look that messy, but it looks like good. Mongo Bong is a good, well, it's getting some new support, so I would say it's probably here. But a lot of things are changing very quickly. The deck hasn't seen much play, but it's because... You need to be a specific engine, and I think it'll get bad when the new support comes out in May for it, in the, in the original set. Soul Soul is one of the best decks still, I reckon it's one of the best decks at the moment, which is cool, really good. Uh, and it's really good when it needs to, it's just really easy to play. 
And Rachira, I haven't seen this deck yet, but I had a lot of good things about this deck. So, uh, it is one of those decks, it's one, one of those decks that's very annoying to play against, yes. But very good when it needs to do, um, ninjas are good rogue option. Yeah, very powerful what it wants to do and stuff, which is cool, which is good. Um... If it was just cash kit in the more format, that th this deck would just pop off and, and win most of the time, but since it's not. Brave decks not been popping up so much recently. Hey, which is a shame, but hey ho, these things happen. Um, but I think it's because some variants of cash or, or cash tier are playing it still, but not many. And there's other decks that don't play the Brave Engine not so much. Uh, tier. Again, it's it's rogue. Nothing much is happening with tier anymore because a lot of the stuff is up one, so kind of beats the object of the deck. So it's kind of a wish win one award. And plus, there's high rise heart in the format, so it's really hard to fight against this sort of deck. To fight against the best deck to format. Sprite, uh, maybe not. Um, Tribe Brigade depends what Tribe Brigade variant. If you're going with the Sprite one. Which most people are, it's probably up here. But the others are down there a bit because uh, Bird Up is not as good as it used to be. Um, I know Starling's at 2 now, so you could do the combo, but but you don't you don't get a chance to do the combo. But there's other versions too. Sprite, tier 1, and then this is the... Evil Twin. The one we're a little bit unsure about is this one here. Uh, well, didn't get a chance. Uh, Gishki Sprite did not get a chance last for my whatsoever. Which is a shame. Uh, but that's because there was no elf. There's no elf now, so it's a lot harder for your deck to go off for the deck. And you have to be in specific zones, so maybe there's a way to do it, but no one has worked it out yet. Plus the zones is really annoying. Um, Sprite is completely changed from the last time I played it personally. Yeah, and stuff, so which is a bit weird because now it's playing the try. It's playing like the, the pencil variant. There's the and there's the, they're playing now the mouthy stuff and they're playing like the evil twin. Not so much Rudix Sprite. But they're playing Ipley now, which is really strange, but I can get what they're doing. Give them opponent their monster, and then suddenly they got Link 1. Yeah. Uh, Dragon Link. Dragon Link's still good, but it's a lot harder with Dragon Link because Cashier could just go, no striker. Yeah, they can just take up their card they, d they need, and that's the problem. And also, it's a lot harder for this deck to combo off, it's not so much. You don't really have many links now in the deck. I know it's getting harder and harder to use your links. Yeah, I know, and it's funny. I Trap tricks. You'll see it in your locals, but never in a big tournament now. We have the strut deck for it, but the strut deck was good, but didn't do enough. If that makes sense, didn't give them like a big boss monster. I know that sounds really strange, but but that's what happened. It also. It's just not one of my favourite decks, yeah. Um, Arena says it's really fun. If you want something that's really fun, and if you want something Cypress, it's really cool and really unique. It's good for you. Arena says it's one of my favourite decks. I quite like the deck myself. Gate Guardian. I think this is next next time. Gate Guardian hasn't done very much. Again, I thought loads would turn up because of, of the new stuff, and thought people put new stuff on Gate Guardian. But I think it's just haven't got the right cards yet still. The deck's there, it's good for the grind, it's good for against the certain decks, but it doesn't have enough for a long tournament, so yeah. And then ABC. ABC's still a good card, but it's just not. It's just post its prime now. And the best way of playing ABC at the moment is with Brave and Brave is not doing very much. 
there is the fairy on now there's new ancient fairy dragon back in the format and stuff which is cool and really handy hey but it's the new one so it's been a ratter so which is good it just means you can't have to get a different name instead of being the same name so you can't get new name for new name for some you have to get dragon ring for new name instead so kind of works out like that same with Gate Guardian, actually, you can't get the field spell for Gate Guardian, you have to get something else, so you have to get Dragon of Rain, then Gate Guardian, field spell. Yep. And stuff, so. There's that. But it gives you that option. Just remember, if you can use an ancient fairy dragon, you can't go into your phase, so. And there's some, so after all that, there's some new Master Duel stuff. And you know what's funny is, we know we've done our tier list today. Guess what, tier elements just come into Master Duel, yes. Now we can have full power of tail elements. Well, not technically full power because they put a lot of stuff at two and keep Carlos at one. So they're kind of doing with the OG. They're hitting a lot of stuff to two and one. Which is interesting to say at least. So, we'll show you what the new pack is like and stuff, and then we'll end it here, so. Oh, there's the new pack. So, funny enough, I was mentioned about the new pack. Here's the new pack. Me 